got an Uber from the airport to our hotel, and Uber upgraded us to an Uber Black, so we are in an awesome Tesla rolling through Hong Kong. <laughs> that is a good welcome to Hong Kong. Tiny, but it'll work. We're in a man. I forgot what it's called. We're right in the like the central business district of Kowloon, which is TST. Tim, Char, Chewy, I'll get that better. But uh, very interesting, we found our room. <laughs> As you saw, it was tiny. Super busy area here, and it's like right above a market. So we're gonna go explore and find some food. After the lodgings we've been staying in the last month or so, we, we need this. Gotta get back to our exploring roots. how this works out. Everything smells wonderful, so it should be great. This is our first meal in Hong Kong, and the food is really good. We got lucky with the ordering. I really like Hong Kong. Um, a lot of people, but um, I'm getting used, I'm trying to get used to it for China. Hong Kong's really cool. It's bright lights, big city. We just got on the, the train from over in Kowloon where we're saying we're gonna go check out Hong Kong Park, which looks beautiful. My type of place, trees. Hong Kong has these at every crossing, which is super handy since I never seem to know which direction to look. Hong Kong Botanical Gardens and animals, I'm in love. And wait till you see the bright colored, it's like the, it's the coral, ibis. Those are my favorites. And monkeys. <laughs> I almost always prefer animals out of cages, except for monkeys. They're safer close up in cages. Would love to get the chance to see orangutans in the wild while there's still a couple left. But uh, this is still pretty cool just getting to see these giant, beautiful creatures here. They're pretty well taken care of, it looks like. The Botanical Gardens in Hong Kong, my number one thing to do because it's all free. It's beautiful. There are animals I've never seen before, not even on television. It, it's, it's peaceful. So, definitely a must do. So I saw these signs that said mid-levels. I asked somebody from here, what do mid-levels mean? They said, it's halfway up the hill. Makes sense, it's a big hill. <laughs> I like going down, I hate this going up. It's a big hill. We're gonna grab a ferry back to TST. Tim Sha Tsui. The ferry is way cheaper than the train. I have to say that was significantly more civilized than trying to get to Manly on a Sunday.
to us. We're on the hunt for some good street food. We're looking for Saigon Street up in the Temple District. And uh, yeah, it's raining, but it's warm. It's pretty. But generally, a place that looks like this and has this kind of clientele is gonna have great food. This is the famous stinky tofu. Spicy tofu, spicy beef and glass noodles. It has a mod flavor, but you can tell the wok is nice and hot and it's charred. It's really good. If you like our video, click the thumbs up and subscribe.